Ever wonder how some startups seem to skyrocket to success while others fizzle out? The secret might be in their approach. Enter the concept of the lean startup, a fresh perspective that is redefining the business landscape. It's all detailed in the book, The Lean Startup, how today's entrepreneurs use continuous innovation to create radically successful businesses, by Eric Ries. This isn't just theory, it's a practical guide brimming with transformative insights. Stick around to discover six key takeaways from this groundbreaking book that can transform the way you do business. First, let's talk about experiments. No, not the kind you did in high school chemistry, we're talking business experiments. Imagine a world where every idea is a hypothesis waiting for validation. That's the heart of lean startup methodology. It's about putting your ideas to the test, gathering data, and learning from the results. This approach can save precious time and resources compared to traditional business planning. Remember, in the world of startups, assumptions can be your downfall. Test, validate, and then proceed. Next up, we're diving into the world of product releases, but not just any product releases, iterative ones. Imagine this, releasing your product in stages, learning from customer feedback, and tweaking it along the way. It's like baking a cake and adjusting the recipe as you go. This approach can lead to better products and happier customers. It's a win-win situation. So remember, Rome wasn't built in a day. Don't strive for perfection right out of the gate. Instead, iterate and improve. Now let's tackle a tough question every entrepreneur faces at some point. To pivot or to persevere. Lean startup principles offer a compass in this quandary. They suggest that you consider a pivot, a shift in direction, when your experiments and metrics hint at a more fruitful path. On the flip side, if your data shows promise and progress, staying the course might be the wise choice. So, listen to your business, it speaks volumes. Remember, pivoting is not admitting defeat, it's about finding the most effective path to success. Finally, let's talk about small batches and validated learning. Sounds like a mouthful, right? But it's simpler than you think. Working in small batches means breaking down tasks into manageable parts. It's like eating an elephant, one bite at a time. This approach increases efficiency and reduces waste. Now validated learning is making decisions based on proven facts, not just gut feelings. It's like having a compass in the wilderness of business. To wrap up, remember this, small steps and validated learnings can lead to big leaps in success. So what can we learn from all this lean startup talk? Well, we've learned that embracing experimentation, iterating product releases, pivoting or persevering, and valuing small batches and validated learning are not just theories, but practical strategies for business success. These six key takeaways from Eric Ries's The Lean Startup can be the game changers for your startup. Consider applying these principles to your venture. Remember, in the startup world, it's not just about working hard, but working smart. With the Lean Startup approach, you can do just that. Please like and subscribe for more book takeaways. Thanks so much for watching.